Quentin Tarantino has responded to comments Uma Thurman made about him in an interview with the New York Times. On Saturday, 3rd of February, the actress detailed a rift between herself and the director, who directed her two most successful films, Pulp Fiction and Kill Bill. The pair fell out over a car crash scene in Kill Bill, when she alleges that Tarantino persuaded her to drive an unsafe car, which crashed and injured her. In a new interview with Deadline, the filmmaker says he wasn't contacted by the New York Times and given the right to reply and so ended up taking the hit and the heat. Tarantino also insists he wasn't furious when Thurman said she didn't feel comfortable driving the car that ended up crashing on the Kill Bill set. I'm sure when it was brought up to me, that I rolled my eyes and was irritated, he said. But I'm sure I wasn't in a rage and I wasn't livid. He admitted the crash that injured Thurman was one of the biggest regrets of my life. He added, as a director, you learn things and sometimes you learn them through horrendous mistakes. On Monday, Thurman posted a clip of the Kill Bill accident with a caption praising Tarantino for releasing the footage. She wrote, Quentin Tarantino, was deeply regretful and remains remorseful about this sorry event and gave me the footage years later so I could expose it and let it see the light of day, regardless of it most likely being an event for which justice will never be possible. H.E. also did so with full knowledge it could cause him personal harm, and I am proud of him for doing the right thing and for his courage. Trantino also tells Deadline that he confronted Kill Bill producer Harvey Weinstein about the alleged sexual assault Thurman experienced in the disgraced movie producer's hotel suite. When he tried to wriggle out of it, and how things actually happened, I never bought his story, he explains. I said, I don't believe you. I believe her. And if you want to do Kill Bill, you need to make this right.